Well, the shortest road stage of the week, also amongst the most demanding. The second of three climbing affairs as the riders uh, made their way to Fermo over 155 kilometers with uh, four classified climbs along the way. The stage that's billed as the Muri, the wall stage, racing towards a ramp conclusion in Fermo. And it was a long time before the breakaway group managed to establish itself. 12 riders finally springing clear of the field after almost an hour of racing. And that 12 riders opening up an advantage of approaching four minutes at one stage. The main peloton being towed along by the UAE team Emirates squad in pursuit of the riders. Benjamin Thomas, perhaps the uh, rider most interested in trying to keep the break away. Best placed overall, just over a minute down on Tade Pogacar starting the afternoon. The rider from the Kofida squad. Pressing on and took the uh, bonus seconds at the intermediate classification to further reduce his deficit. Inside the final 10 kilometers, it was a select group of uh, seven riders clear of the field. Meanwhile, from the group of favorites behind, an attack from Remco Evenepoel, but he, Tade Pogacar and Jonas Fingergor went the wrong way and had to quickly reset and get back into the group of favorites behind. Meanwhile, in the approach to Fermo on the final wall, it was Warren Barguil that raced clear of the rest to take stage honors for Arkea Samsic, the 32-year-old Frenchman taking a first stage victory in Terreno Adriatico. Behind him, Zandro Maurice got up for second on the day. And Simona Velasco from the early break, hanging on for third.